details are now confirming that the British terrorist Luthwaite lived in Nairobi for seven months without being noticed by authorities. Investigations by British news networks suggest that the woman known as the, the White Widow rented an apartment in Nairobi in 2011 using her fake identity, Natalie Webb. Samantha, who had earlier been spotted at the coast, also wrote a passionate poem in praise of fallen Al-Qaeda leader Osama bin Laden. KTN's senior coast reporter, Ferdinand Omondi, takes a closer look. This is the apartment in Lovington where Samantha Luthwaite, also known as a white widow, stayed in for seven months. The white widow is believed to be the mastermind of the West Gatera attack. is said to have stayed here in the year 2011. It all began when a woman approached the caretaker in search of accommodation. Sasa kanielezea kuna friend wake e, nyumba ya Nakumat Junction alimwachia viti kwa nyumba na mama dress the caretaker says all he did was to show her the available house after which all screening would be done by the landlord kama amekubali nyumba waende walipe kule town mali anafanya kazi sasa ndio walienda huko wakalipa nyumba alafu wakarudi wakaingia kwa nyumba the woman who took the rented house overlooking the Nakuma Junction Mall identified herself as Natalie Fai from South Africa. This is the alias which intelligence agents believe Samantha had used successfully in her travels. UK channel Sky News is now reporting that British intelligence found evidence against Samantha which led them to the Nairobi apartment. The trail begins in a house in Mombasa where detectives examining the hard drive of a computer left at a house found several portraits of Luthwaite including one where she posed with two of her children. According to Sky, the flash drive also showed she married a suicide bomber and had spent eight years researching chemicals, explosive ingredients, and how to make bombs. These pictures, released today by the UK's Daily Mirror, show Samantha with her lover, a man identified as Habib Ghani, with whom she is suspected to have lived in Mombasa. The latest revelation suggests that Samantha had at least three residences in Kenya, one in Lovington, Nairobi, and two in Mombasa, Nyali, and Shanzu. Samantha Luthwaite had been wanted in Kenya over a plot to kill hundreds of Britons back in 2011, during which time her suspected associate Jermaine Grant was arrested. Grant is now answering to those charges. Jermaine was grabbed in a fourth residence, this time in Kisauni, Mombasa. After the Westgate attack, Interpol issued an international red notice for Samantha's arrest, describing the terrorist suspect as a worldwide danger. Ferdinand Mundi, KTN, Mombasa.